Hello, in this problem we have to determine the exact value of sine of 4 pi out of 3 and we are given the instruction that decimal approximations will not be accepted which means we shouldn't use a calculator. The thing about exact values it will be one of those 30, 45 or 60 degrees angles and in radians they are equal to pi out of 6 pi out of 4 and pi out of 3. Since our angle is way more than one of these, let's begin by finding the reference angle. So here we have x and y axis, zero radians is on the positive x axis, we have pi out of 2 on positive y axis, pi on the negative x axis and 3 pi out of 2 on the negative y axis. We are looking for reference angle of 4 pi out of 3. This ratio means that pi is being multiplied by 4 and divided by 3. If pi is being divided by 3, let's divide 1 pi on our graph into 3 equal pieces. In our ratio we have 4 pi out of 3, so this means we have 4 of these pieces. So here's the first piece second piece and a third piece. 3 out of 3 gives us one whole. Since we need four of these, we need to divide the second pi into three pieces as well in order to have four out of three parts. So here's our fourth piece. So this angle is four pi out of three. Since we are looking for reference angle, reference angle is always with the x-axis, so we need to find how much this is. And from this picture you should be able to tell that this is just 1 pi out of 3, which is just pi out of 3. If you are not comfortable with radians, you can absolutely change 4 pi out of 3 into degrees, find the reference angle, solve the problem and convert the answer into radians on the last step. So the reference angle for 4 pi out of 3 is just pi out of 3. This means that if we want to calculate sine of 4 pi out of 3, we can calculate the exact value of sine of pi out of 3 and get the same expression. However, since we are working with the reference angle, we need to be careful about the signs. So here we have all students take calculus. Our angle falls in a third quadrant where tangent and its reciprocal is positive, which means that sine is negative there. So in order to calculate sine of 4 pi out of 3, if we are using the reference angle of pi out of 3, we need to remember that sine is negative in the third quadrant. And now we can proceed with calculating the exact value of this expression. If you remember the ratio for sine of pi out of 3, you can go ahead and answer this question now. If you do not, it's very easy to derive a reference table. Unfortunately, it's only in degrees. So we have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, square root out of 2. And sine goes from left to right. We have sine of 0, 30, 45, 60, 90. It's all in degrees. We are looking for reference angle of sine of pi out of 3. Pi out of 3 is equal to 60 degrees. So in this reference table for sine of 60 degrees is on top of radical 3. So sine of 60 degrees is equal to radical 3 out of 2. This means that sine of pi out of 3 is also equal to radical 3 out of 2. And we need to remember that the sign is negative in the third quadrant, so negative radical 3 out of 2. So exact value of sine of 4 pi out of 3 is equal to negative radical 3 out of 2. And this is our solution. That's all.